you need a new shout out command. I have a new and a better updated version. It's called Clippy and I'm gonna show you guys how to set it up for your stream. So your shout out commands could be way better and way cooler. Clippy is basically a shout out command integration within for your stream. So it lets you use the shout out command and it will play the clip of the raider or the person that you wanna shout out. It'll show up on your stream. There's a lot of cool little settings that we're gonna go through so I can help you guys use it more optimally because there's audio fixes that we have to go through. I'm gonna show you guys right now how to set it up on OBS. Let's get to it. Go into the Clippy website, which I'm gonna put the link in the description below so you guys can go into the website and either log in or sign up. So now that you have it all downloaded, you're gonna get to this Clippy page which is your basic settings. And there's gonna be a URL. You're gonna to wanna to copy this URL and put it into your OBS settings as a browser source. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. If you don't know how to do that, I will be more than glad to show you how to do it. I know you're eager to paste that browser setting, but there is one step that you gotta do before doing that. You're gonna to wanna to go into settings. You're gonna to wanna to go to your advanced tool thing, whatever. And you're gonna to wanna to scroll down at where it says sources, enable browser source hardware acceleration. If it's unchecked, make sure to check it. The reason why you're checking this is because sometimes Clippy can be a little glitchy or just a little stuttery in the audio. If that's happening to you, make sure to go to this step first so that does not happen when you're shouting somebody out with the command. Since you still have that URL link copied, you're gonna to wanna to go into your browser source settings right here. You're gonna add a browser source, you're going to go here. We're going to put a Clippy test. You're going to add that. You're going to go into the URL section right here. Whatever you copied, paste it in there. You don't have to adjust any width or height. Everything is fine the way it is. Before you go in and just click OK, make sure to click Control Audio VIA OBS. This is basically going to allow you to have your own audio setting here on your audio mixer. You're going to be able to see an extra one there just for this source, which is good because you're going to need that for later on in the video. And then put refresh browser when becomes active. Now that you have it added, you see it's right here at the bottom. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna see Clippy test right here and your audio browser source. What you're gonna wanna do so your stream and yourself can hear it through your headphones whenever someone's getting shout out because that's the whole point of it. You want your audience or your viewers to hear it. You're gonna wanna go to advanced audio properties, go in there where it says Clippy test at the top is gonna say monitor off because it's defaulted to that, but you're gonna wanna change it to monitor and output so both can hear it, yourself and your viewers can hear it. We're gonna first test it out before the audio filters that we added on it. So we're gonna take that off now. Now we're gonna shout ourselves out and we're gonna see how loud it is. It's not that loud. Thank you so we much for the support. We're peaking at red. <laughs> Look at that. Look, it's going. Yeah, this way is this is a really. I just added the audio filters. I'm gonna do another shout out command, and we're gonna see the difference. That's Probably why when I pulled for him. Yes, that's very soothing to the ears now. You know, it's very right, light. You know, I can still hear it. Mean, now I'm gonna show you the audio settings here. Here's the shout out command, and right uh, here so at the bottom, you see it's chains. staying in green, barely peaking and at yellow. Um, this is how you want it. If you'd like, just join the Discord. I will show a screenshot of those settings so you could use those appropriately, so it doesn't mess up the eardrums of your viewers. Just make sure to join the Discord in the description below so you could download those filters for free. You can go with whatever command you like. I think SO is just a lot more easier. There's options down here, which is really cool. You can have your mods do it for you. A lot of mods and, and streamers chats, they will shout out the person if, if you ask sometimes they do it they can actually have the command and the clip pop up when they put it in the chat which is really cool i mean it gives you other options you could do subs vips or everyone personally i would suggest doing mods those are people that you really trust you could do everyone but it would just destroy your stream and everybody would be probably spamming it leaving it on mods is the way to go or if you don't have a mod just take off the mod and, and when you take it off it'll work for you only you can also do date ranges you could do any date i personally would pick last year because if you do any date it's gonna show maybe before last year or you could do last month as well there's gonna be a lot of clips that will pop up at any time between that last year so it will probably be good and you could click either random or top i prefer doing the top because that has probably the most views i think random sometimes you know sometimes people clip random things that don't make sense or are, are out of context best clips is the best way to go so you could understand who they really are as a streamer if you have a lot of people let's say two or three people ready to do at the same time you can cue those clips and it will go appropriately in order it doesn't it won't spam so crazy we have another command called stop so stop basically ends the clip completely if you want to do stop all it will stop all the ones that are in queue oh, exclamation point mute or exclamation point unmute next feature here which is probably my most 
favorite is exclamation point watch but sometimes they'll clip whatever and they'll link it in the chat box and that's cool and all to like watch it but if you put exclamation point watch the clip will actually pop up let's just pick an example somebody has clipped this you want to be able to share it do this right you're gonna copy this right someone already clipped it you're gonna see it going to the chat that's below right you see it down below you see the link cool but the problem with that is you're not going to be able to watch it. So the way it works is you're going to put exclamation point, watch do a space and then do paste the link. Boom. It's not that loud. And it will pop up right here. So you're going to see it. It's just really, really yeah, cool. You're able to share what just the moment that just happened recently. And it's great. I love this is my Thank favorite so feature much. of oh, everything. Okay. Pick individual clips, which is really, really cool. And it could make your stream look even cooler because, you know, some people want to just relive it or maybe they missed it or they want to know what's going on. So you just do that and they'll watch it again there you guys have it there goes the full tutorial on, on the new and better updated version of the shout out commands this is definitely going to spice up your channel if you use this if i miss anything let me know in the comments below hopefully this will help out your stream and make it more rewarding for any raiders or viewers you know so it's a really cool command if you want to know more about any other tutorials i would really appreciate if you go watch these two videos right here i basically have a fast and audio setup for your elgato if you just got an elgato make sure to check that out or if you're trying to figure out how to set up your alerts and all that and set up your stream you could watch these two videos and it will help out your stream a ton so thank you guys so much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out bye